It was a crime that left North Brisbane in lockdown and three police officers fighting for their lives. Now, 15 years on, one of the men shot by Nigel Parodi at Chermside has been awarded for teaching others about the importance of resilience. Hanbury Street, a place full of painful memories that's fueled a fire to fight on. Now I can come back here and just say, hey, this was just a piece of my life. It's not all of my life. It doesn't control me. Australia Day 2000, a time when North Brisbane was forced into lockdown. Three officers were responding to a disturbance in Chermside. Constable Sharnell Cole, Senior Sergeant Darrell Elliott Green and Sergeant Chris Mulhall. All were shot at close range by crazed gunman Nigel Perotti, who ambushed their car, then ran away. Back up 47, back up 47, please. Code 2. Officer down. Get a car there now. It was the start of one of the largest manhunts Queensland had ever seen. Streets were blocked and with fears the gunman may have taken hostages, cars were searched with officers' hands never far from their sidearms. After three weeks, Parodi was found dead in local bushland. Now, 15 years on, with the case closed, Darrell is still in blue. He works with the team of Police Link, turning that moment of horror into motivation. Out of that darkness, I actually achieved all these great things I probably wouldn't have done. I probably wouldn't have gone and done a master's degree in finance. I wouldn't have gone and climbed Kilimanjaro for charity and raised $20,000. Spoken to now to over 2,000 people and imparting lessons of resilience. And public speaking has been part of a project Darrell created himself called Twice Shot. A problem shared is, is a problem halved and that was very key for me. I did bottle a lot of things up. Darrell's story has already touched thousands of Queenslanders and thanks to winning the prestigious Carol Nan Scholarship, he'll now be able to visit even more schools around the state to deliver his twice shot seminar, one that teaches the power of resilience. It's uh, just a, a fantastic reward and, and especially when I share those lessons I'm so passionate about with an audience and people come up to me and say, oh my God, I got so much out of this. But Darrell is getting more out of it admitting talking about that day helps his own pain fade away. Sean Power, Nine News.